Hello everyone, my name is Eric, but you can call me Blade Walker, and welcome back to 7 Days to Die Alpha 21.1. This is going to be our first ever pre-recorded, recorded, whatever, uh, modded series, and it is, of course, Darkness Falls. Now, I am using the pre-generated Darkness Falls uh, specific map, which is 8 kilometers. It is called Small One, No PEP. I forget what PEP stands for, but basically it's player-made POIs, and... I personally don't really care for those. Now, my understanding is that because this is a pre-generated specifically by and for Darkness Falls, it does have the specific POIs that are needed for, like, the story, but it doesn't have anything beyond that other than vanilla POIs. So, with that said, these are the settings. I am doing Adventure because in Darkness Falls, they re-enabled the, <clears throat> excuse me, the game stage bonus for difficulty, which means the higher your difficulty, the faster your game stage goes up, which means you're going to run into the demons, and the demons kill the game for me. So I want to prevent that as long as possible. And by demons, I mean specifically the ones that appear in POIs as sleepers. I don't care about the ones in the wild. I just, it makes clearing POIs for quests or just in general unfun. My opinion. So that's all, that's why we're doing that. Also, he added a crit bonus now. Which, basically, the higher the difficulty, the more likely you are to get crits. And crits are basically things, the debuffs. Uh, infection, broken, sprained arms and legs. Uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, basically, all that stuff. Uh, so, we're going to leave it on adventure. It isn't because of the zombie difficulty, because you guys know I play on Warrior. I'm not worried about them dying easy or hard. I just don't want to deal with those two things. The next thing is uh, land claim blocks. Default for vanilla, I believe, is also three, but I'll probably never make more than three, but screw it, five. Uh, for these, this time I made sure to increase the Blood Moon count. Nightmare speed only on Blood Moon, everything else default. I noticed you can't increase the XP multiplier. He disabled that, which that's fine. Uh, advanced, I uh, turned on uh, drop on death, nothing. Now, I just don't like doing bag runs in general. However, in Alpha 21, they added an option you can spawn near your bag. However, when reading uh, on the Discord for Darkness Falls, I don't know if it's still in Darkness Falls. They might have fixed it, but there was a bug where the game would basically crash. Something to do with spawning near your bedroll when you died, or I don't remember. Point is, just in case, I'm turning that off so I don't have to worry about crashing the game. Multiplayer, as usual, it's the same stuff. I don't want to be able to take damage from my own explosions. Maximum claim size for my uh, uh, land claim, longest duration, bedroll for the, the bedroll, uh, what do you call it? Oh, that's a dead zone. Oh, well, I don't really care about dead zone. I wonder if it's always been that way. I thought it was different. No, oh, okay, I did have it right. Okay, so anyway, there's that and that and that. Those are the settings, and let's get moving. Hey, here we go. Welcome, thank you for the support. Extra thanks to testers. Make sure to check your uh, journal, of course. Uh, no one expected the end of the world. Military came. Explosions, I got knocked out. One of the survivors explained that this is a safe zone. Da -da -da. Zombies found me first. Uh, okay, that's fine. Alright, so here we are. Now, there is one and one only change that I made to the mod, and that is in the bottom right corner, I re-enabled, uh, as you can see, there it is, the XP pop-up. I re-enabled it because I like that. Other than that, absolutely no changes to the mod at all. 100% unmodified. So, let us go ahead and read this. We're going to keep the land claim for now. Put this down. Back the backpack contained a, a tattered map. Looking at it. Mark with X, White River. Okay, so that's the White River Settlement. We're going to equip that, which gives us a few. I do mean a few of those. All right, we're going to put this down. Weird that it started us in the thing, but I guess the snow biome, but I guess it's so close it doesn't really matter. All right, so give me a couple of seconds. We're going to go ahead and get prepared, and then we're going to head to the base. Now, for those that don't know, I recently started recording and uploading in 1440p, which is basically a resolution halfway-ish between 1080p and 4K, partially because I like the higher resolution and I can't do 4K because my monitor doesn't support it. 
But because of that, the file sizes are roughly twice the size and take anywhere from 50% to twice as long to convert and upload. So I'm going to try to keep these episodes under 30 minutes if I can. But it's not going to affect you guys at all watching. It's only going to affect me when I'm converting the files or the videos and uploading them. I'm simply letting you know that if the videos sometimes are short, that is why. There, it, it's not, it has nothing to do with you guys. It won't affect you in any way other than you being able to enjoy a higher resolution, but it will affect me, so that is the reason why I will be doing certain things. Anyway, I will see you guys in a moment, because again, trying to cut down the video time, I'm going to uh, make some stuff, and I will see you at the trader. <clears throat> okay. I saw a wolf over there munching on a zombie. I was like, yeah, that, uh, they, they can do that. <clears throat> okay, so on the way here, I just basically grabbed a bunch of crap. Let's see, made some arrows. I'm going to figure out that later, the class. Uh, I opened a mailbox and grabbed the red tea recipe, so that's nice. Looks like it's Trader Jen, so that's good. Go ahead and do the usual, rob her blind. Apparently these uh, scouts have their own uh, series of quests. I'm going to do... Can you help me? How far away is that? 300? Yeah, we can do that. They've got their own faction reputation thing, so it's probably not a bad idea to do those. Wow. Okay. Really? I don't know what we're going to take as far as weapons or perks. I was... I usually go labor... Wow, this is ridiculously slow. Uh, the traders are not protected, as you can see. You can damage their stuff. However, you cannot build on it. Supposedly, according to Kane, the creator of the mod, he said he did that for multiplayer servers so that it doesn't become a mess at the traders, which, I mean, I get that, plus probably griefing. Because, you know, humans suck. So... You can destroy everything at the trader, but you can't build here, which really sucks because that means you can't protect the trader. You can't, like, not even, like, just around the trader themselves. And personally, I think that's kind of stupid, but, you know, that's my opinion. I do like the fact that the trader's always open, and I also like the destructible trader, but I don't like that you can't build here. Because that makes... That means you're, you're never safe when you're at the trader, so... Yeah. That's unfortunate, but not the end of the world, of course. Uh, I ended up brightening, or turning the brightness up to the maximum until we get a helmet light. If it annoys me enough, I will spawn in a helmet light. Because honestly, a helmet light is actually more of a detriment than it is a help. Since zombies can see you from further away. Now, of course, if I did a stealth build, that would really suck. But since I don't typically do stealth because I suck at it, ooh, that's a good find. Both of those are. No, not modify. Equip and equip. What else Jen's got? We're just grabbing all her stuff. Wear it. I did make a full set. Oh, oh, I got... Really? I, geez, I was not paying attention. Did not realize I got those. All right, so we're going to go ahead and put that down here. Maybe I'll do... Pipe batons. Because I know in Darkness Falls, he's got like an entire series of uh, batons and stuff. High-end ones. Since they, they fixed, in my opinion. I, don't, I mean, they buffed it, but to me, it's not really a buff. It's they fixed it. <laughs> Batons were awful before because they just, just were. So, 17 bucks. I guess we can just sell that? Yeah, that'll work. Grab a little bit of cloth. He uh, reverted the cloth change for Alpha 21.1. So, you don't need a ton of cloth to make stuff. So, yeah, I'm not doing that. Oink. Oh. Let's go ahead and talk to Jin. We're going to get a quest, and then I am going to drop a bunch of stuff off, and we're going to continue. You don't look, look so, so good. good. Yeah, I know. You might want to get some antibiotics for that. Do Dell's Cafe. I like Dell's Cafe. Have a nice reward for you. That's good to know. So, let's go ahead and sell that. Not gonna sell those because I'm gonna use them. Don't need that. We're gonna sell that. I probably 
I did get a wheel in that truck right where we started. Go sell that sucker. I think that's probably it. Does she have antibiotics? Yeah, I did a little test uh, playthrough. Not playthrough, but a little test streaming earlier tonight. Or I guess by the time this comes out, Saturday night. And, uh, yeah, I ended up getting infected, and it got up to, like, 63%. He made infection go up much, much. I'd say it's at least twice as fast it goes up. It's pretty crazy. And I, you, uh, when you get honey, it's not a guarantee that the honey will cure you. It took five honeys before one even started healing me, or, you know, the, the infection. Four of them in a row did nothing. Yeah, that sucked. Rice milk stuff's pretty darn good. So it's already afternoon on day one. I'll go up here and get this stuff. Ugh. I forget who told me about this, but somebody told me about this little these little shelves and, 20, and Alpha 21 Experimental. I was very happy. No oh, eggs? None? Not a one? Oh, that's a game. Got I've noticed a lot of loot has nothing in it. Totally empty. Really, uh, kills my interest in looting, and it's already not very high. Especially since there's no magazine. But there's other, there's schematics and stuff again, so that's cool. Snag all these. I always wanted to grab these in vanilla, because it's like, look at all the free stuff. All of this, some of that, and none of this, and none of that. All right. Got what you got. Okay, free stuff. I'm gonna drop everything off here shortly. That's why I made a bunch of uh, chests. Okay, clay is nice. Okay, more good stuff. Oh, so encumbered. Where is the city? Looks like it's to the south, so... We want to make our our temporary base on the south side. We're gonna... Let's go ahead and check out the recipes. Like I said, normally I go labor. Mechanic would be good for getting vehicles, so that's not a terrible idea. I was thinking, you know what, I was going to do Farmer, but I think now I'm going to do Mechanic. Mechanic. Craft. Read. Get some basic tools together. Now, like I said, the reason I'm doing that is because that's going to allow me to get vehicles significantly faster. And you know what, I'm a fan of vehicles, so. Exit is. Of course, this is almost broken, but it's good for now. Let's... Come on. Ow, you douche. Really? I'm completely out of stamina? Couldn't repair that. Why are you standing still? Yeah, now you're talking. We've got some skill points. Yes, three. Alright, sexy T-Rex, and then... Hmm. You know what? Hmm. Close this for a moment. Now that I think about it, there aren't... Increases damage by increase by using blunt weapon. You know what? I think he just changed everything. Instead of having individual weapon type uh, perks, it's either a sharp weapon or a blunt weapon. Okay, so that means whether you use sledgehammers, clubs, knuckles, or batons, yeah, you know what? I'm, I'm, I'm down with that. I am definitely down with that. Completely. 
Uh, let's see, is that better? Yes, it is. Scrappeth. Fair. Scrappeth. Doesn't matter because as soon as you do anything, it immediately. Uh, don't need those. I've got plenty of that. You know what? Just throw everything in there. You. And... You know what? We do need that, so let's go ahead and. Anything here I want? I think so. Can't see anything. It's all so dark. Eat resist plus 20? Absolutely. We've got a cooking pot, so let's go ahead. I definitely need the. Take that and. No, no, we're not. Because I may. I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to want to make that. But campfire. When you and then throw like there's my wood. Apparently I put my wood away because I'm a dipstick. It is I'm gonna go ahead and craft up some water. They're a minute apiece, so there you go. Don't need that. Alright, let's go. Let's get these quests done. But as usual, I will see you guys there after I loot all this stuff. Okay, apparently I came to the wrong quest, but that's alright. We will definitely, happily, murder these guys. Level 3. Shoot! Oh god, you scared the crap out of me. Get away from me. Now, if this is like the older uh, versions of this mod... And these quests, you don't actually have to kill these guys. I could just run away. And then whenever I kill these mobs in the normal world, regardless, you, uh, you'll you get credit for them. Really snort at me. There we go. Blunt weapons increase. That means... I put the first point... And I'm gonna Pete and thunk. Gotcha. Ow! Yep. Douche. Got it. Alright, bloated walker, so I gotta kill Mo. There you go. And only in the interest of time, we're just gonna we're gonna bounce. We're out. So as before, I'll see you guys at the first quest. Now that's the traitor. Where is the quest? Quest, quest, quest. There it is. Alright, I'll see you guys at the quest. Okay, here we are. Oh yeah, that's right. We did. Uh, we just did this POI on the stream la or earlier tonight or a couple days ago by the time this comes out. It was not too bad. I don't recall if it had a dog in it. I think it... I feel like it did. Yeah, it did. Dell's Bakery, I do below it. Bell's Cafe, excuse me, I do believe he does have a doggy dog. And you know what? Let's go ahead. Make a couple of these and then... I'm going to lay this down here once we start the quest so I can dump everything in it. We can loot unencumbered. Oh, really? Really? You want some of this? I don't think you do. Course. She's like, well, you gotta hit me first. Yes, you are correct. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ooh, an even better one. Of course, once I repair it, it's gonna... Oh, you know what? That is better than the one I got, so we'll take it. This, over we go. In fact, I think this is the same map that I used for the stream, and I'm pretty sure this is the same same uh, area we spawned in the stream. All right, I got three points. Let's see what we got. Okay, don't care, don't need it. Three blunt weapons, pummer, pummer, pummel, Pete, brawler, bladed weapons, blade guy, knife master. 
knives and swords. See, why does that one say knives and the knives and swords and then the blunt one does not? That is... But, yes. Lock picking. I don't know. I'm tempted. I want mechanics, so salvage operations. This monkey. Dirt bikes? Yes, please. I see him coming. Uh, robots. Da, da, da. I want salvage operations, so yes. Although, now that I think about it, I took that because I was thinking it would unlock the wrench, or help me unlock the magazine for the wrench. Ooh, gotta forget. Or remember, that's not the mod remove that, so. Alrighty. If you wonder where I got the die, I looted a. What do you call it? Uh, yeah, that thing. A poncho. A cloth poncho? Okay. And it had red dye in it, so I snatched it. So, one, two, three. Four, five, six. Now I can just dump everything and not worry about it. I don't think there was anything up here. Nope. All right, down we go. Good stuff. Nope. Duck a seed. Bunch of other stuff. Oh, you know what? I didn't even notice this last time. Hell yeah. Now I can get out. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. All right, come on. Give me some good stuff. Good stuff. I'll take that. I'm not getting food poison. No, thank you. Not a bad drink. Good to hear. Don't care about that, and it's not really worth anything. Bullet tips. Nice. Archery tips, not interested. Rather have the skill point book thing. In here, just dump it all. I want the paper. I don't know why I'll need it, but you know what? If I don't take it, I'll need it and not have it. Bones, stuff. Yeah, you, you, you go ahead and beat on that door. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Seems like the only thing that really works through the doors well, melee-wise, is the spear. Everything else doesn't really work all that great. They work, just not well. Got nothing. Oh, human turd, just what I wanted. That's what I always wanted. Definitely take that, and we'll keep that for later. Anything in here? Yeah. Oh, it's lootable. 20%? Oof. Doing any of that? Screw that. More paper. This was where the dog was, isn't it? Yep, there it is. Woo! I will take that. I did get hit, but you know what? That's fine. I can live with that. What are you doing? Oh, laptop. Take this. Oh, yeah. Really? You're still not dead? Damn. There you go. Ooh, Mega Crush, that's a great find. Okay, quest not complete. There should be two people in here if it's the same as it was. I believe it was Jiggles and a... and a businessman, too, so that's perfect. Well, not perfect, but it's the same as it was last time. Ooh! That was mean. 
Okay, blunt skill weapons go up. Yep, so that is what it is. Doink all this crap and get the heck out of here. Okay, orange juice. Scrap the gloves since I now know I'm going to need all the stuff I can get. I don't have any armor. Oh, yes, I do. Yes. Well, this should reload a little faster. And, of course, the animations. Are they ever going to fix that? I love the animations, but they don't work 90% of the time. Damn it. What you got? What you got? Unlock, unlocks farming tips, but perk by one level. Absolutely. 50 bucks? Yeah, I mean, I'll, I guess. I'd rather have the leather at the moment. Alright. Oh, open. Now I get the fun task of running all the way home. Yay. All this loot. Okay, empty. I'm pr did, did I loot everything in the front? I don't think I did. I did not. Crapple. Ooh, that's a good find. Very good find. I'm going to be so encumbered. Don't need... You know what? I don't even care. Just get it down there so it's less encumbrance. Once I pick all that stuff up out of that box... Oh, it's going to be slow going. You guys aren't going to have to watch that, fortunately. Not going to make you watch me painfully creep all the way home. Chrysanthemum. Yeah, we're good. We don't need more chrysanthemum. 34 each. Alright, I will see you guys when we get home. Praying I do not run into a wolf. Did I reload this? Yes, I did. See ya, buddy. Oh, well, I could outrun him, but I'm thinking it's probably just better to murder. Did I say failed prepper? Oh my god, it does. That is hilarious. Failed prepper. All right, see you guys at home. Okay, we're back. I dumped everything off. Let's go inside. Now, what now? Well, you're inside, aren't you? Yes, you are. Let me cap you. Little googly eyes. And googly eyes is down. Yep, 225 XP. Done. All right, let's go see what we get for these two quests. I'm already doing infinitely better than I did on the stream earlier tonight, so that's good. Boom, down you go. Like a sack of potatoes. Well, aren't you a sight for Sora? Well, that didn't take long. Ooh, that's... Oh. I want the wrench. Oh, Jen, you you kill me. You kill me, darling. All right, the dead rooster. I would love that is food. Two more jobs this week, I will give you employee of the month. Sweet. I want to upgrade the doors as much as I can. All right, what you got for me? Great job. What are you looking for? That's tempting, but I think I'm going to take the hunter. It goes in any melee or ranged weapon, but not tools. Okay, that'll work. Got. Uh, we'll do lady killer this time. You? Can you trust me? Of course you can. Oh, I realized. All this stuff has to come off. Okay, not all of it, but a lot of it. All right, let's go and loot all of this stuff. Sorry, Jen. This stuff is going to prove to be very, very useful. I have the red tea schematic. Oh, it's true. I have the red tea. Huh? Oh, there it is. Red tea. Got a bunch of water here, so that is so beat. What was that? Oh, I'm hungry. Okay, well, that's fine. Oh, wait. Where is that? Back. All right, you took my ammo, didn't you? Okay, good. Give me the ammo back. Eric rifle barrel. All right, I don't know. I killed one chicken earlier. It was dumb enough to stand still. I ran right up and clubbed it. Okay, so I always forget animal fat. I got plenty of animal fat. Well, maybe not plenty, but some. Two minutes, and that's one minute for that. Wow, I'm not used to these reasonable cooking times. 
which is not a thing in vanilla anymore. We're going to throw you and you and you. And of course, you're going to drop on the ground because... Oh, there we go. Perfect. I'm going to put this, I don't know, like here. Like we got another failed prepper. Yep. Thunk. And thunk. Thunk. And thunk. I am leveling up super fast. All right, guys. That is going to be it for the first episode. And because we're pretty much at night, I believe. Which is perfect. So I hope you guys are enjoying this uh, mod. And as I said, if this isn't your thing, no worries. This is not going to be the only series we do. We're going to be in vanilla. We're going to do more mods eventually. So if this isn't your thing, no worries. Oh, jeez, I'm, I'm a parrot. Anyway, uh, there's lots more to come. So I hope you guys enjoy it. If you did, feel free to leave a like or uh, subscribe. Thank you all for coming. And of course, as always, I will see you all in the next episode. Have a great day, everyone. Tasty.